Hey my love bugs, some of you requested to see what I do with those hawk tips that I purchased. So this is the beginning. I have cut my nails down underneath and I am applying this hawk curve tip to it. And I am getting ready to apply the acrylic. And I'll come back and update you guys. I got these hawk curve tips from the beauty supply store for 99 cents. And I'm going to do it myself because if I went to the salon, it would charge me an arm and a leg. And I have my little handy dandy drill here, which I want to purchase another one that's cordless because that one gets kind of aggravating. I have my acrylic and my primer and everything, so I am going to get started and I will come back. Okay, guys, I am back and this is the finished product. So let me hold my nails like this. Um, it was actually a little bit more difficult than I thought. I actually love the thumbs the best, but it was actually a little bit more difficult than I thought because one thing people don't know about curved nails, the way you apply the acrylic can actually take the curve out of the nail. So I had to be very, very careful, very, very careful with laying the acrylic. And I'm just a basic acrylic layer. Like I said, I did go to school to do nails. I did get my certificate, but it's been years. I usually just do touch-ups on myself or fix what I need to fix. So, yeah, but I do like that I do have the little curve, the little hump in there. So I am feeling that. So now I just have to wait for my nails to grow back out. And all they will do is grow back out to the length of the nail. That's all they will do. They will grow underneath and they will grow back out. So here they are, and I am getting ready to polish them, and I'm going to use this blue polish that was given to me by MKB Lady. I'm not going to trip, trick them out too much. Um, I've been a little sick, so I think that I'll just polish them. Please go on Instagram to see the pictures of the finished product, and then I'm going to go to the nail salon Saturday and let them kind of uh, fix them up for me, dress them up for me. They don't charge you for that. <laughs> so it's kind of like a trick of the trade. I'll do what I need to do to them and then when I go get my fill if you get a really really good girl which I found a really really good Chinese lady in the salon here if you get a really really good girl she'll be like oh I need to fix this I need to fix that I need to do this I need to do that I can't just let you walk out of here like that and I actually love that because anything I missed especially on my right hand seeing as though I had to do it with my left hand um, will be fixed you know, any uneven acrylic and everything will be fixed. So it's just going to be a basic polish, basic look. But I will put pictures on Instagram. So follow me there. And I'm going to get ready to start polishing. So I'll see you ladies another time. Okay, friends, here is the finished look of the nails. This was very difficult because, as I stated before, or I don't know if I stated before, but when you're working with a massive curve in the nail, the way you lay the acrylic can actually change the curve in the nail for those of you who don't know so I laid it pretty good because I still have like pretty much of a curve or a hump in the nail so yeah I've been drilling and filing all day I am tired I am going to go to the nail girl this weekend and let her finish drilling and fixing them up for me but so far I am satisfied with it I've got a little bit of a hump or curve in there my thumbs are my favorite my thumbs are always my favorite usually my pinkies are too but I don't know, I kind of messed those up. But my thumbs are my favorite. I love the actual curve. So this is what they look like. And I will be at the nail salon this weekend letting her fix them up. And I may go back with this color again. MKB Lady gave me this polish. And I I actually adore this polish. It's a blue, but it's a, it's a crazy blue, a different color blue. I actually, actually love it. So I may put this color back on again and uh, decorate them myself again because I'm not going to pay the girl to decorate them. I've actually been going to just a regular nail salon. Um, so, you know, they charge for every stone, every stripe and all that kind of stuff. So I can just do it myself. And I've done some stripes and diamonds here and I've done some swirlies here and I've got my two blinged out nails and my plain nails. So, yeah. So that is the outcome. It was requested. Um, normally, I just touch up my nails and do what I need to do. But this time, I did a full add-on of a hawk curve tip. And it was not an easy task by far. 
but this is the finished outcome and I did have to cut my nails underneath but nails are like hair all they do is grow back and since I had already cut them before it wasn't too detrimental for me to do it again so that is that your girl is done I'll see y'all next time